Uh, right now, I am going to talk about cyber psychology as a transdisciplinary science of human computer interaction. On one side, if we see humans, and on the other side, if we see computers, like it is the relation between a man and machine. There are some features in computers which directly or indirectly affects the affective, cognitive, behavioral, or we can say the overall personality related aspects of humans. Whether you can think of any program that is executing in a right manner that is not giving any kind of pain or stress to a person. But on the other side, when the computer starts hanging or the processing starts getting slow, you can see the stress, the tension, the frustration in the cognition, in the affection and the behavioral patterns of a human who is using it. So somehow there is something which we can say that there is an interface uh, which comes in between the humans and the computers and that interface is called human computer interaction kind of phenomena where happens. Cyber psychology as the name says cyber is basically related to the phenomena of internet that is worldwide where related all kind of that cyber space where millions and millions of people across the globe are interacting with each other every day and they are sharing their news, views, ideas, feelings, emotions with each other and the way they are feeling uh, are getting shared on the cyber space those feelings are somehow the resultant of the mind the behavior of an individual and as we all know the psychology is a science of mind so even what you see in social networking site what you see in various websites various blogs various micro blogging sites all the stuff which is getting text there or uh, the images which you found there the sounds the videos which you are definitely seeing there these all are the resultants of the mind of individuals sitting around the globe so when the resultant of mind is coming on cyberspace that definitely means that there will be a kind of phenomena that can be termed as cyber psychology means even the content which is presented on the cyberspace in itself works as a projective technique to understand the nature behavior phenomena and overall personality of an individual so on one side the humans and computers are interacting with each other and that human computer interaction is giving a space to cyber psychology so overall cyber psychology can be considered as a transdisciplinary science where not only psychology of computers is working rather if we go in deep then we can say that various patterns related to neurosciences various patterns related to further educationists various patterns related to the deeper realms of all kind of sciences are getting seen because the input is coming there so on the basis of that we can draw some kind of conclusions out of that particular phenomena so basically cyber psychology the way it works the way people interact with each other the group dynamics which we form the individual's behavior which we form when a single statement becomes a reason for a big big revolution so all kind of thing you can say that there is a big mind global mind collective mind collective consciousness and that collective consciousness is a cyber space and that cyber space is own psychology is known as cyber psychology and overall we can say that yes cyber psychology is a transdisciplinary science of human computer interaction and we need to understand it in more proper manner.